Hi there, Trailer Park fans. It's Jolene Sugarbaker, the Trailer Park Queen. And welcome to the Trailer Park Test Kitchen, where I'm testing a new recipe. And earlier this week, I talked on my Twitter about my candy thermometer, as you see here. I bought this at a big box store, and it's very hard to find candy thermometers. And I complained about it because, I mean, look, you can barely see what temperature this is going at, and... It fogs up, and it has some sort of wooden ball and some clip that never really clips to the pot right. And I don't know. I just don't like this candy thermometer. I wish there was another one out there. Do you know of another candy thermometer that's out there that's better than this one? I mean, I, this is all I find out there these days. Except, you know, some of the battery-operated ones just don't go high enough. Uh, when you're making candy or deep frying or anything like that, they only go up to about 200 degrees, and I need it to go up to about 300. But this is that candy thermometer that I talked about on my Twitter stream, which I'm Jolene's trailer there. But leave a comment at the bottom or on my Facebook page or uh, put out on Twitter and uh, talk about candy thermometers because I'd sure like to find a better one that I can actually read what's going on here because... This week I made some um, Divinity and it just failed too. And I guess, you know, it's just hard to, to keep the temperatures right. And if you can't read it, that's a big problem. So leave a comment at the bottom. There'll be more cooking shows soon. And just around the corner, be sure to watch my past ones on my YouTube channel. I love y'all and I'll see you back real soon. Bye-bye.